And here I am, back again. Yes, this is the power I've longed for. The mighty power of souls. They assault any threat that tries to destroy them. What, what do you mean? It's trance. You know how it works. But a normal trance won't be enough to defeat you. You're all as resilient as Oglips. Even tiny Moogles possess the power of trance. When I saw that in Galug Volcano, I came up with a plan. It was easy. I just needed to borrow the power from wretched souls that can't die. Where did I acquire it? It was the invincible, or should I say, that large eyeball in the sky. The ship sucked up the souls of Madain Suri, the Ifa tree, Alexandria, to feed upon them. When it fought Bahamut at the Ifa tree, the invincible drew in a powerful spirit. Can you guess to whom it belonged? No. That's right. It was your mother's soul, a wretched soul that clung to life to the bitter end. The souls trapped inside the Invincible welcomed me with open arms. They were fed up with being your prisoners, Garland. So, Master Garland, you are no longer needed, and after you've worked so hard, I shall rule Terra and Gaia with my unconditional love from now on. What will you do with such power? Master Garland, you of all people should accept defeat gracefully. Gurg. How sad. Any last words? Your power is meaningless. Dot dot dot. Gah! Now it's your turn. Should I kill you quickly to show my appreciation for all you've done? Or should I kill you slowly and painfully to show you my love? Oh, I've got a great idea. How is this? I'll make you pillars for my castle. You'll all decorate my castle as a symbol of my eternal kingdom. How do you like that? No. Never. You could never build an eternal kingdom. That voice. Garland? Did you leave something behind? Do you think a defect like you could last forever? What? What do you mean? I built you to last only until the worthy gnome Sedan grew. It was too dangerous to let you last any longer than that. What are you saying? There's a limit on your life. You'll be dead soon. Even as I die, you'll have died without ever leaving your mark on the world. Dot dot dot. Ha 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 ha, what an interesting lie. You're telling me that my life will end soon. Ha 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 ha, nice try, Garland, but I won't fall for your silly tricks. Garland? Dot dot dot. Garland, answer me. You were created to destroy, you are immortal. Immortal? I'm finished. I don't believe you. Why would I believe such a silly story? You're telling me that I'll die soon, now that I'm more powerful than anyone. I'm gonna die? Lose my soul? Ha! Ha 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 What comedy, Sedan, isn't it hilarious? I'll die just like the black mages I so despise. I single-handedly brought chaos onto Gaia, but in the end I'm nothing but a worthless skull. Kuja. Why is that funny to him? Kuja? <laughs> I won't let it happen. I won't. I won't let this world exist without me. I actually feel kind of bad for him now. Is that wrong? <laughs> I mean, I hate him still, but I feel kind of bad that he now knows he's going to die. Oh, Jesus. Gotta destroy everything, don't you? Kuja, I can't believe him. 
it on, we gotta get out of here before the tower collapses. But how? We need to carry the injured out, too. Let's steal Kuja's ship, the Invincible. It's at the bottom of the tower. Oh yeah, but... Alright, you guys head for the ship. Exclamation question mark. I'm gonna rescue the Gnomes. They're victims. I can't just abandon them. I'm coming with you. Dagger? I don't want you to leave us again. So I'll keep watch over you. Okay, we should be able to go back through the warp gate on the other tower. Dagger and I will head back to Bronn Bell. You guys come get us on the Invincible. So it's just me and Garnet. I got stuck. <laughs> you know, Kooch is actually a pretty good villain. He's one of those tragic villains. Which is interesting. Looks like a teleporter leading to the upper levels. It might take us back to Bronn Bowl. Ah! What's wrong? But behind you. They're just eyes. It's okay. Let's go. Just eyes? How very bold of you. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, um, dagger? Yes. Um, about what happened earlier. What is it, Sidon? Oh, jeez, I feel like I'm being watched. <laughs> you are being watched, though. Just say it. We need to hurry. Um, you came to my rescue, right? And, uh, what you said to me, it made me really happy. Sidon? How can I say this? Um... Thanks. That was kind of funny, because he's like standing there trying to admit his feelings for her. <laughs> it's great, I love it. Hurry, hurry, this dinky old tower is gonna collapse any minute. Dinky, huh? It's the weirdest word I've ever heard. They're just casually walking. I know find good food on Terra. <laughs> Maybe I eat eyeball over there. Queena, hurry up or you'll be left behind. I happy we leave. No good food anywhere. <laughs> Always thinking about food. I think we're still okay. Let's evacuate the gnomes. My freaking head is just... Jesus Christ. My bad. I'm sorry. I got itchy all of a sudden. It might be because I washed my hair. <laughs> so Don, let's split up. Yeah, I'll go this way. We'll meet up with the Invincible when the Invincible arrives. My gosh, this ship is enormous. Judging from our current position, I believe the bridge is that way. Hold it, where is Queena? Arg, is she late again? Ho ho ho, I arrive. I warp inside from bottom of the ship. Why were you underneath the ship in the first place? Save it for later, we must get the ship moving. <laughs> exactly. What are you still doing here? We need to evacuate. What's the point? They're only empty vessels. Stop talking like that. Do you really believe what you just said? Unlike the rest of them, Garland gave me a soul that I might replace you and Kuja. But Garland is dead. Terra will soon be destroyed. What's the point? I asked myself the same question. Did you find an answer? No, but maybe the point is ju to just try. It's gonna be hard, but I've got my friends. It isn't too bad so bad, sorry, dot dot dot. 
Hey, what's your name? Huh? Garland gave you a name, didn't he? My name is... Makoto? Makoto, huh? That's a nice name. A lot of people are gonna call you that from now on. You have to find the answer yourself. It'll be hard, but you can do it. Let's go to the new world, Makoto. There you can find your answer. Nagger, where's Sedan? He'll be here any minute. He's looking for the last gnome. Sorry to keep you guys waiting. Sedan. Sorry I'm late, but we got now we heh. <laughs> but now we got everyone. Everyone on board now. We must leave immediately. We made it. Yes, we managed to escape from Terra, but what's wrong, Freya? Well, I was talking to Amarin about it earlier. You don't think this is the end, do you? Are you talking about Kuja? Do you really think he perished with Terra? Even with his power, it's hard to believe that he'd have escaped unscathed. What do you think, Sidon? What will Kuja do next? He'll probably try to destroy Gaia. But how? There was one thing Garland said. Something about a tree that serves as a gateway of souls between Gaia and Terra. That must be... Yeah, it's the Aoife tree. Everyone. You must come look. Come with me. What's up? Ugh. My throat disagreed with me, I'm sorry. <laughs> What's up, Steiner? Can't you just tell us? It would be faster to come see it on the bridge. Okay. Whatever you say, dude. What's up? They're just clouds. It's not a normal cloud. What? Let's lower our altitude and see. Don't you see? Our altitude is not very high, and this is all we can see. Then what could it be? It's mist. Excuse me? Uh -huh. It's what black mages are made out of and what used to cover the mist continent. The mist has covered all of Gaia. Why? How? Kujo, what are you planning now? How do we know he did it? I mean, I'm not doubting it, but how do we know? I'm gonna assume it's gonna ask me to change the disc in a minute. Yep. <laughs> Ready to go. Why is that so far? Thanks, they were uneasy at first, but I think they'll get along fine. There's no need to thank me. You've done a, us all a great service. It wasn't a big deal. Well, anyway, everything's gonna be okay. Are you sure it's okay for them to stay here? Of course it is, so this was Vivi's idea. Yeah. 
he wanted the gnomes to start their new lives here. We're similar in many ways. Maybe we can understand them better and they might open up to us. Right, he also said, if you guys can get along with the gnomes, maybe humans and black mages can live alongside each other someday. Like you and Vivi, I didn't even know if I truly understood him until recently. We'll take good care of them. Your friends are our friends. Thanks. Is this a monster? He's a chocobo, not a monster. He's called Bobby Corrin. <laughs> That's a funny name for a chocobo. Oh, you gave him a name? Yeah, Bobby Co Corwin. Isn't it a great name? Sounds great, Bobby Cor Corwin. Uh, exclamation question mark. I think Bobby Corwin likes you too. It won't bite? Oh, come on. He's just a little baby chocobo. Exclamation question mark. Baby Corwin, no, come back here. Wow, I think Bobby Corwin really likes your new friend. Our new friend, I think it said. Never mind. Can't you just call him by his first name? Why do you display these items? Why? For the customers, I think. What are customers? Well, they bring money and they hand the money over to the shop and then... What is money? Money is, uh... Why do you care about small things? World is a very simple place. World only have two things. Things you can eat and things you can no eat. You know can eat. Sorry. Dot 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 dot. Does the water here ever stay still? Water flows, doesn't it? The water of Brown Ball was always still. Hey, did you know that time flows just like water? So water and time both flow in Gaia? Dot dot dot. <laughs> Looks like they're off to a good start. <laughs> it's like watching kids play. It's not their fault. They've only just begun to live their lives. Can lost time be recovered? I don't know, but there's only one thing that thing we can do. Of course. We must protect them from anyone who tries to take their time away from them. Princess, yeah, princess, why'd I say it like that the first time, Jesus. Is this what you really wish? Hmm? What are you talking about? Kuja must have done something in the Aoife tree to cover the world in mist. Do you not think it, it, it wise to consult Regent Sid before the final battle? Kuja probably plans to sh on destroying Gaia. If I go to Lindblom now and tell the Regent about it, it might cause a panic. I'm sure everyone is apprehensive about the reappearance of the mist. I need Uncle Sid to protect Lindblom right now. Indeed, we must defeat the enemy on our own. Even if we go back to Lindblom to get equipped, please don't tell Uncle Sid about our plans. Are we ready? Yes, let's go. You haven't got a chance. You saw Kuja's power. He destroyed a world by himself. You don't even have a million and one chance of defeating him. You all die. Dot dot dot. Wow, this girl knows lots of difficult words. Doesn't she? She's a bit cynical, but take good care of her, will ya? Her name is Makoto. She's kinda like my little sister. What? Makoto, listen to your big brother and make some friends. H how silly. We might be desperate in s insects to Kuja, but I'll show you how powerful we can be. Even a fly lives for a day. I don't think that's what Sedan meant. Let's go f to the Aoife tree. We won't let Kuja have his way. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Give me one minute, guys. Please.